The greatest opportunity that I see in front of every developer is to start thinking business. My mission is actually to turn every developer from being a, a builder of apps and a supplier of apps into actually being in the business of apps, which means being able to understand uh, who their customers are, being able to understand uh, what's the right distribution model, being able to understand uh, what is the best and most effective way to monetize from their apps. That is something that needs to be in the thinking since the very beginning when you're actually developing an idea into an app. So it's all about return on investment. And how do we guarantee that return of investment? First of all, is through distribution opportunities. If you do not have volumes, the opportunity is simply not there. So by giving opportunities to developers to reach customers all over the world and be able to emerge from the crowd uh, creates the baseline of the opportunity. You're starting to have volume, you're starting to have customers. And then uh, the next phase is how to actually monetize and how to actually capitalize from that distribution. So we're giving more and more tools to developers to be able to monetize. One very important tool is, uh, for example, the operator billing. Many countries have uh, characteristics for which uh, uh, you know, the use of credit cards uh, to purchase content is simply not practical because either people do not have credit cards or do not have, uh, uh, you know, they don't want to use them online. In many countries, people, you know, there's large percentages of mobile users which would, for example, do not have a bank account. In those cases, operator billing is a, has a tremendous reach and actually can create an opportunity to monetize. Every time we introduce mobile billing, we see a, an uplift of over two and a half to three times in terms of transactions. We're taking that to the next level by allowing different business models, such as try and buy, or such as, for example, in-application billing. In Nokia World, we announced in-application billing for our Asha family, and in application billing is particularly important for the target segment and for the countries where that the Asha family is, uh, is targeting. In application billing will be linked to the mobile operator billing, which means that uh, 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 developers will have the ability through an SDK to a, and through a series of API calls to be able to monetize their app within the app by connecting directly to over 134 mobile operators. And I think that's absolutely an un unprecedented opportunity. If developers start thinking about the local opportunity first and then uh, they start to expand that consumer base globally to try to find the same type of audience everywhere else in the world, then they really get into a very interesting path that can keep them into profitability without stretching too thin, but you know, really stepping from uh, being a local hero to be a global hero. We talk to them, we teach them, for example, uh, you know, how to uh, localize their app, how to write the right descriptions, how to write the right uh, screenshots, how to put the right price point. We engage them to understand what is the, the, you know, the distribution policy, which countries they want to address. We promote them on the store. We also even promote them on the above the line campaigns. We give them exposure to consumers, but then we give them information about the, 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 uh, um, uh, the distribution and, uh, and, 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 and the breadth of, uh, of uh, for example, countries that they're reaching, what are the different patterns of downloads in the different devices so they can understand better who their target audience is and then they can develop a better uh, offering consequently. Yeah, Rich Care has joined uh, our organization very recently. We, in fact, uh, uh, announced uh, uh, his appointment uh, at Nokia World. Rich Care comes uh, from uh, HP, where he uh, used to be the head of developer uh, relations there uh, for WebOS, previously at Apple, previously CTO of Lucasfilm. Uh, it's a person that is uh, absolutely the right uh, uh, you know, uh, talent and the right uh, experience to lead this global effort to reach in developers and really, really turning them into businesses. You have to understand the development side, you have to understand the business side, you have to have, uh, most importantly, an absolutely great appreciation of what the opportunity is. And Richard and I have been talking about this, uh, you know, quite a bit, uh, you know, when he was joining Nokia and, you know, is as excited as I am to bring this opportunity to developers.